We begin tonight with a story that has inspired thousands on social media. A Snagelo, Texas Roadhouse waiter recently went viral in parts for their extraordinary service, but also because they're deaf. Here's more. A social media post that went viral was a photo taken here in this Texas Roadhouse in San Angelo. Now I met with Mario Briseño and the staff here to talk about the impact that post has made. It's a Facebook post with more than 42,000 shares, all because of what's printed on this handout. The first two lines read, Howdy, my name is Mario and I'm deaf. I will be taking care of you today. I met up with Mario Briseño, the waiter behind that message, and with the help of American Sign Language interpreter Gina Bolden, we were able to communicate. Briseño says going viral was a surprise. I actually cried. I got pretty emotional, and my fiancé and I both did. He was asking me, are, are you okay? It was just so unexpected that it had gone viral. Mario remembers the encounter they had with the person who made the post. They didn't think anything of it at the time. I first started and I just, I tried to be um, just cheerful with her. I asked her, you know, how your day is. Um, and then I saw that she took a picture. I didn't think too much of it. And I signed to her, um, what would she like to drink? And she, she said, sweet tea. Briseño has had several jobs in the past, but working as a server was made possible when Mario's brother, Cello, who also works at Texas Roadhouse, told his boss Mario was interested in the position as a waiter. We had an interview and we talked just like I would interview any other employee. And I think the biggest thing that sold me that I really thought he had a great chance to be successful and overcome any, you know, any, uh, you know, challenges that may come with this is, man, his smile. Uh, that was the biggest thing I told him during his interview is that million dollar smile right there is going to be what's going to be your money maker and it's going to be what makes you su successful. Mario has the same task as all the employees at the restaurant. Noak says Briseño's work ethic speaks for itself. He's always been a guy that could be counted on. Um, he's got a great attitude and just got a great energy about him. Mario has been a waiter for a little more than a month and the reaction from the San Angelo community has been overwhelming. Our guests have really just been great. I mean, the people of San Angelo have been great and they've welcomed me with open arms and there really hasn't not been like that situation where there's just a lot of snags or anything like that. Briseño says despite the shares, likes and comments the post is getting, it's the message behind it that's important. I want to make sure that the deaf community shows, it shows um, that the deaf community can be equal to the hearing community and that just we can do anything um, that they can do and um, it's a big change for the community of San Angelo as well and I just like showing that we can we can be equal and I want other deaf people to realize that they can do it too. As for what's next in the future for Mario? A long-term goal is I would like to be uh, become a superintendent um, at a school at a deaf school, a residential deaf school, um, or a mainstream public school, either way, but I would like to become a superintendent. For now, Mario is enjoying serving tables and would like to get promoted in the near future.